What's up guys, it's Cole Bennett. It is currently 3.44 a.m. December 12th, Sunday. Well, it's technically Sunday, but Saturday night. And um, I don't know, I'm editing the ski video that I shot on iPhone yesterday and the night prior. And I just wanted to get on here and explain why I've been shooting some of my music videos on iPhone. Uh, there's a few reasons why. One of which is to show that, you know, you can make a music video with the phone in your pocket. You know, obviously there's a lot of things that can help take it to the next level. Uh, some of which are, you know, colors. I think uh, colors that complement each other and can create a theme uh, and a palette throughout a music video is very important. Uh, good lighting is incredible, especially on these these phones, you know, that the, it shoots like a cinema camera um, with good lighting. Uh, editing is important and you can learn everything you need to know through YouTube tutorials that's how I learned everything I know and then lastly and most importantly a good idea and I think with a phone and you know those few things I think that you can make an incredible music video uh, with what's in your pocket another reason is if you've been you know, following my work since like 2015, 2016, 2017, or even before then, uh, then you remember the days when I was putting out videos all the time. It was just me and my camera and the artist who I was shooting with and just going through the city of Chicago, just shooting and, and putting stuff out the next day or two days later all the time. And, uh, you know, these iPhone videos kind of take me back to those days and it kind of gets me back to my roots and back to the basics. It's uh, it's fun because it's no stress. I'm shooting on an iPhone at the end of the day. So, you know, uh, no no big budgets, no budgets at all. And uh, just me and my friends having fun. So I did the first one with Yachty. He came to Chicago and we just, we had a blast and we just shot all day. Um, and I'm doing the second one with Ski. I'm gonna do a lot more, but it's gonna be a segment that I do. Uh, you know, every couple months I'll do one, maybe two. Who knows? Uh, maybe a lot more, maybe a lot less. I really don't know. But uh, it's just exciting for me. I have a lot of fun. It makes me feel alive. It makes me feel good. Big production budgets and big production sets and resources and big equipment and you know crews are incredible. I think that it is important to communicate um, you know bigger ideas and and you know more complex thoughts and obviously it captures. Uh, a wider audience and they can maybe understand it a little bit more and that's something I'm always gonna do I, I love the fact that I'm blessed enough to to be able to work on big productions but the iPhone video just it just takes me back to uh, a different place and I think that it can show a lot of people that you can do it and you don't need a ton of stuff and I want to like let people know that you guys could do this too and like you we, we can all start doing this you know we can make music videos on iPhone I know a lot of people who've been reaching out to me, it was like, yo, I've been doing this, this you know, this, this is what I've, you know, catch up. And uh, so it's amazing to, to see that people are realizing that you don't need some fancy camera or really a camera at all, because to get into it, cameras can range from three to $4,000 uh, and a whole lot more, um, depending on what you're looking for. But you don't, you don't really need that anymore. And as time goes on, you're gonna need that less and less. So I just want people to understand that you know, the entry level into making music videos is lower than it's ever been. And I think that's an exciting thing. To some people, they may be annoyed, but I think that's beautiful. I think that it's a good thing, it's a great thing. And a lot of people also ask me, well, who do I work with? I don't know anyone who, who makes music. I, you know, so many people make music now where you can find someone in your town, a town over. Uh, back when I started, like eight, nine years ago, in my small town that I grew up in, in cornfields in the middle of nowhere, I had my friends make music so I could make the music video. You know, I, I mix and mastered their songs on GarageBand uh, so I could, you know, make the music video and they'd record the song on their headphones. And uh, we just make music videos and we were each, you know, they got to practice their music and I got to practice uh, my video skills. and. It, it, it was life changing, you know? So I, I think the, the first thing is figure out if this is something you're passionate about. And if it is, go out there and just, just create, just have fun. And uh, yeah, I'm just, I just wanted to get on here real quick, explain why I've been doing this, why I will be doing this. And 
yeah, it's a segment I'm gonna continue to do. No, Apple is not involved. Uh, they have not uh, even reached out to me or given me any money at all. If they do come around, I'm not complaining about it. Um, and that'd be cool. But I just want you guys to know that this is just something that um, I'm doing because it's fun and it feeds my passion and my creativity and it allows me and my friends to just have a good time. You know, me and Ski, the other night, we just like, it felt like we were in 2016 again. Uh, Cause me and him, we've worked on all sorts of videos, really big budgets and then, you know, zero dollar budgets. And Catch Me Outside, arguably our, our, our best music video, or the fan favorite, um music video of, of mine and skis and then arguably some people's favorite lyric climbing music video of all time which is me and ski running around times square with my camera we picked the song as we were walking out of his hotel room we didn't have any treatment no budget we just we just had fun and like him losing his hat as he hung out the taxi was natural that just actually happened but it created its own story its own narrative so just go out there have fun do your thing like I said, me and Ski the other night, just me and uh, us and my iPhone. And it felt like, it felt like we were where we were tw in 2016. And like I said before, uh, growth is very important. Getting to, you know, elevating. And, and I think that is great, but right now I'm having fun with, 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 with just the basic. And uh, obviously I'm still gonna be doing music videos. I've been doing them. Um, but these will be sprinkled in there and I'm working on another video segment, music video segment as well. So it's like we have the classic music video segment, which is what you know, the iPhone music video segment now, and then the next music video segment, which I can't tell you guys what it is, but it's, it's groundbreaking. It's insane. But, uh, hopefully I'll roll that out in a few months. I'm still working on it, but, uh, big things are on the way. And, uh, yeah, and I shot this, I'm, I'm, this is, this is, a cinematic mode on the iPhone 13. Like this is fucked up, this, this is ridiculous. So uh, yeah, just go out there, make some shit, have some fun, watch YouTube tutorials and just, just do the damn thing.